Odyssey Training's SharePoint Site Owner Advanced course teaches you how to create a form in Microsoft InfoPath and just how easily it can be linked to a SharePoint list or form library. This video shows you how easy it is to make that link to a SharePoint form library. On your screen is an InfoPath form that's already been created in InfoPath Designer. Don't worry, you'll learn how to create this InfoPath form in the class. Now, the form that you're looking at has already been saved, previewed and tested. It's ready to be linked. From InfoPath's File tab, select Publish. You want to publish it to a SharePoint server. In the Publishing Wizard, type in here the name of your SharePoint site. Click Next. You want to enable this form to be filled out by a browser and we want to create a form library, so select Next. We would like to create a new form library. Click Next. We're going to name it Staff Expenses in this case. Click Next. Now what we needed to do is add all the columns from this form, all the fields, uh, as to which columns we would like to display when the list is viewed in SharePoint. These have come up because I actually have done this before, but to add them you would simply click Add. And from all the available fields, you would choose which ones you would like to display. Choose them from the list here. If it's something that needs a bit of calculation, you can choose the calculation available. Click OK. Here are our columns. We select Next. Double check your details of the link we want to make to SharePoint. Click Publish. At the very last step here, in InfoPath Designer, you can select to open the form library and when you click close, it takes us to SharePoint. Here is the form library that we just created. Now there's going to be a few more steps we need to do, but we've run out of time today. You'll have to come and do the class to learn how to make that work completely. But just to check, if I click on a new document here, it's going to open up my form and I can start filling it out. That's what's covered in the Odyssey Training SharePoint Site Owner Advanced course. 